Welcome to the last set of news, take the top stories in cryptocurrency digital assets, and break them down to bite-sized pieces. Today, I just want to go over a couple of things, and it's going to be all about staking Polkadot and how it's super brain-dead simple it actually is. Well, before we get into that, I just want to take a look at the market, and uh, congratulations to everybody. We have hit our all-time high of 28,078. Actually, no, that's, that's not true. I think at one point it hit like 28,400, but this is a good day. If you are a, a Bitcoin holder, uh, you've been waiting for this uh, for quite some time, and uh, once it hits 30,000, I think it's really off of the races. I think once 30,000 gets hit, it's a psychological barrier, and then people are just going to pile in. I mean, we've seen a lot of different uh, great stories come about, especially with all the different publicly traded companies, uh, MicroStrategy, Mass Mutual, and a couple of new ones. Even like uh, the Mooch and his uh, hedge fund is getting into the game. So I believe it's going to be uh, pretty big times. And I was concerned that at the very end, we'd have a lot of people dump for uh, tax reasons because they needed to sell for their taxes, but it doesn't look like that's actually happening. At least not in Bitcoin, not in Ethereum. Uh, they are off of the races. Ethereum, 2.8% up for the day and looking at 7.30. That's massive, 15% for the week. Yeah, that's what's going on with the market. Uh, exciting times. I think 2021 is going to be our year. I, I just don't think you can really miss for 99% of the cryptos that you put your money into because it'll all just go up. Uh, that's about it. The only downside I could see is uh, this this SEC um, case dragging out, but anyhow, we'll see. All right, let's take a look at uh, staking. Okay, so here I am on my dashboard for Kraken, and uh, I've got a couple of different assets. I have a bunch of dollars on here. I actually forgot about that. Uh, Ethereum, couple of those. Cardano, sure, Polkadot. And this is the thing with Polkadot, right? So already, 24-hour change, up 18%. Not too shabby. So what we're going to do is we're going to right-click, or actually just left-click on the three dots right here. And then we're going to click on, instead of uh, trading, we're going to stake. So stake. Okay, so here's all the things that we can stake. Pretty cool. You got Polkadot, uh, Kusama, Kava, Cosmos, Tezos, Flow. Never heard of Flow. And Ethereum. Interesting. And then uh, it gives you, breaks you down all the yearly rewards. And it's pretty interesting. I mean, uh, pretty good. You have between 5 and 17% for Ethereum. That's a wide swath. 7% uh, for Cosmos and Polkadot, 12%. Now, you can get uh, other interest rates that may be a little bit uh, a higher or higher yield, excuse me. Uh, but for here, I mean, this is just brain dead easy. And so really what you need to do is uh, take a look at uh, what the criteria is and all the ins and outs. So this is on the blog post uh, that I will uh, link in the description below. And it talks about on-chain staking, uh, just what it is and how it compares to everywhere else. So with Kraken, uh, you can start earning rewards instantly, uh, payouts are twice a week, that's pretty cool. Highest returns in the industry. And that's true because I saw uh, Polkadot on uh, the Atomic Wallet. I think it was like around 7%. Check me if I'm wrong in the comment section. I'm sure you will. And uh, of course, you can stake within three clicks. Pretty nice. And instant unstaking. That's the interesting part. So uh, as it states in a little bit, uh, you can unstake at any time you want to, which is pretty cool. And it talks about on-chain staking, which is pretty much all of them. Cosmos, Ethereum, Flow, Kusama, Polkadot, Tezos. Here's the rewards, which we just talked about. Uh, Polkadot, uh, 12%. Man, that's all. That's pretty high. And then this is the big thing, time. Unlike other staking services, at Kraken, there's no minimum on-chain staking time. That's pretty big. And this was interesting. It says, uh, for example, if you only utilize on-chain staking for a few hours and then unstaked your funds, you would still be credited prorated rewards on the next payout day. That's pretty amazing. So it looks like to me, it's either you can stake as long as you want or as short as you want and then pull it and then that's it. And then just be aware that it is not possible. Whoa, it is not possible to stake or unstake on mobile because the Kraken API, which is what the most mobile apps based on, does not have any commands for staking. So if you want to stake, you have to do this on your desktop. So if you're on your phone, which is like most of us all the time, uh, you have to go to your desktop and do this to stake. So that is about that part. But just to be sure, let's take a look at how to unstake. And this is, uh, this is interesting because it says, note at this time it's not currently possible to unstake staked ETH or flow for the information you can found on uh, this FAQ. So the same way we staked, it's the same way we unstake. We click on the three dots, Click on unstake and the amount you want to uh, actually unstake and then click the button and that's uh, pretty much it. And then what's great about that is that there's proof because under the transaction section, uh, there's a little entry where it says uh, initiated. A few minutes later, it will, it'll change to success when you unstake everything. Kraken also has insurance on their cryptocurrency. So I'm gonna do it. Let's just uh, stake it right now. So I'm gonna click on stake. And how much do I wanna stake? Well, let's just do the max, see what happens. So I have 122, it allows me to stake 122. Uh, payout interval is twice a week. In other words, 12%, I mean, that is 
unbelievably high. I like that. Let's see how long that could last. Is that sustainable? Well, only time will tell. And then grow rewards. What the heck? It states growing your rewards means the rewards you get from staking these assets will be added to staking. So it'll just be like a uh, perpetual flywheel like Celsius always talks about. So the 12% that I get in DOT will go into my DOT account. I will actually then start staking and we'll just keep going bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. So uh, sure, let's stake that. And then thanks, uh, assets will appear in your staking wallet when the transaction has been completed. This may take up to a whopping 10 minutes. All right, then that's good enough. And I have to tell you, I gotta tell you, I was actually pretty uh, tempted, let me go back to staking, to uh, stake my Ethereum. But in all honesty, when I saw that you couldn't unstake it, and I believe it's it's a lockup for quite some time, I wanna say uh, months to years. Again, check me in the comment section, but uh, I know it's a very long time. You can't unstake and you can't even do it here on Kraken. So what I like about Kraken here is that you can just do it and uh, off you go. So there's actually a couple of places you can go to uh, stake Polkadot and a lot of different places, but uh, you're welcome to find all those out and see which ones are best for you. This is the one that I found that's gonna work for me, especially because it's so simple and it has does have a high yield. If you're looking to sign up for Kraken, I have my exchange of wallet fees, which you can look in the description of every one of my videos. There's a link that looks just like this, and you can use the affiliate links. Now on Voyager and Celsius, for example, you get between $20 and $25 to sign up for Bitcoin. Kraken, I don't believe you get anything. I, I could be wrong. But all the, all the rest of them, it's pretty much uh, the same type of thing. You get between like $10 to $25 worth of Bitcoin if you use the links. You don't have to, but it's uh, totally up to you. Also, as far as staking, uh, Digital Asset News uh, has a Cardano staking pool. We're less than a month in and we're almost at 25% uh, saturation, meaning that uh, for every Cardano staking pool, you can only uh, put in or delegate up to 63 million. And after that, it'll look something like this, where you'll have you'll be saturated and everything over 63 million, you actually start to lose rewards. And for this one, uh, it's heavily saturated. And all these people, I don't know, this has been like this for like two weeks. Uh, people just don't pay attention. And they don't realize that, hey, once you hit a certain point, uh, you can't stake anymore. I mean, you can, but you're just going to lose rewards. So what's the point? And for D News, uh, you know, we have almost a perfect uptime. Uh, we're very new, we went less than a month, but we've put a lot of things in place to make sure that we get the maximum amount of rewards. So if you're looking for exactly uh, what we're all about, how you can stake and everything else, in the description below, again, there's a, a link, looks just like this, and it'll take you to our, our stake pool page. And once you get there, easiest way to do it is just click on wallets. It'll swing you all the way down and watch this video. It's about 13 minutes and it'll explain uh, exactly what we're all about, uh, how we do things, uh, how we set ourselves up for success in the future. And also the, the best part is how to stake your Cardano to make passive income. And that's between four to 6%, which is the industry average. All right, that's it for today. So thanks for sticking with me, Dan. I really appreciate it. If you like those types of videos, uh, there's gonna be two more that's gonna pop up on your left and right. Not exactly sure, I'll let, Car I'll let uh, Cardano, I'll let YouTube do their magic. And uh, that is it for today. So uh, thanks again, appreciate it. And I'll see you on the next one.